And who wouldn't want a nice pair of Louboutins? How you can get knockoffs with the help of a little red paint. Could you tell the difference between real Louboutins and a cheaper alternative? Well, Liliana puts you to the test. I hope I can tell the difference. Plus, how to get the red sold look without breaking the bank on Louboutins. Plus, they're the famous red soles every woman loves. But can you spot the difference between real and fake Louboutins? I don't know, but I think we're about to find out. We are going to find out. Now, when you see a woman wearing a pair of heels with a red sole, your first thought is she paid a fortune for those Louboutins. But now, there's a sneaky way to get the same Louboutin look, and that's exactly what Liliana did today. All right, give us the secret. That's right, ladies. I was able to find a way to get that signature Louboutin look for less. And I'm talking way less, like $32 less. And this treatment is so popular with fashionistas who are just tired of shelling out hundreds, sometimes thousands of dollars for those red soles. You're going to be pretty impressed. Take a look. They're sexy, they're expensive, and in one word, they're red hot. Christian Louboutin signature red soles have legions of loyal fans, but they're no stranger to controversy. Just last April, the company sued French design house Yves Saint Laurent for trademark infringement after they started selling red soled shoes. And now the battle has moved from the courts to the streets, as women all over the city are seeing red over a new service that makes those signature red soles affordable for the masses. Andrade Shoe Repair on the Upper East Side offers a red sole upgrade, which transforms a pair of ordinary shoes into look-alike Louboutins by painting the entire sole red. We wanted to get a first-hand look at the process, but got this instead. We don't do interviews. Well, what if we shot you from the back? so we didn't actually reveal your process. No, no cameras, I'll just bring in the shoes. Shoes only. Wow. I'm actually on 85th Street between 2nd and 3rd. I've got a pair of regular old non-Louboutins and I'm going to see what this signature red sole treatment really does. $32 to have the entire sole painted red. Here we are at Saks on 5th Avenue. Now their shoe department has their own zip code, so I'm pretty sure they've got a pair of Louboutins. I've got my very own pair of Christian Louboutin shoes. These babies are expensive. Armed with the real Louboutins and my newly painted Louboutins, it was time to put them to the test. Which pair of shoes up there is the Louboutin? Is it number one or number two? Number one. Number one. Do you like Louboutins? I love it. Do you own Louboutins? I do. Two pairs. Is Louboutin the number one pair or the number two? I think number one is the actually you know what number one number one number two number two I would say number one Okay. I'd say Louboutin is number one. The majority of people we asked picked the steel as the real deal. So before you spend one month's rent on these pricey pumps, ask yourself, are they really worth it? Now, I did call the Louboutin store here on Madison Avenue right behind me to ask them for comment. They had nothing to say. So that leads me to ladies. What do you think? You have them right there in front of you. Can you tell the difference or not? Uh, looking from the back, if you look from the back, you mm -hmm. can't tell. I mean, you can see the names, but if you look from far away, you yeah. can't tell the difference. Yeah, but. I can. I can see where people would be uh, would would not pick the right one. But thank you so much for the shoes. They're yes. our size. We're gonna wear. Yes. We're gonna trade <laughs> off every We're other gonna day. We're gonna fight for them. <laughs> <laughs> right, you guys Liliana. are gonna want to thank Amy for those shoes. <laughs> liked you doing that though that was really yeah so just hold those up one more in the bottom see they do they look they really look the same they do thank you Liliana Jane's not letting go of the real ones I'm okay. not <laughs> let's go to Rafi I've got them <laughs> and find out what's going on with the weather